testing, testing, one, two, one, two. I've been so unmotivated lately. I have been dealing with spring cleaning. I don't know what spring cleaning means, but I'm basically going to be cleaning. And I've been thinking about what the future holds and what my job is going to be like and what traveling is going to be like. So I have to get prepared for all of that in the coming spring. Honestly, I've been a little bit lost about what lies ahead in my future and staring into the great unknown. <laughs> but sometimes when life feels overwhelming, the best thing I can do is focus on the little things. One of those little things I do do is actually reflect on my past. And this recipe is something that my mom used to make when I was little. And it's basically ground beef. You usually add rice or wheat to it, but I just had ground beef and I seasoned it very well. And you wrap the ground beef in each cabbage after you boil them and you place them in a pan or a baking dish. They're called Niño Envuelto in Spanish, which means rap child. Not rap like the music, but wrapped like swaddled child, maybe. I basically pour like this tomato based sauce on them and I place them in the oven for like 25 minutes. They are so delicious and it just brings me back to my childhood when my mom used to make this. While I'm dealing with my struggles with what lies ahead, I've been just trying to focus on figuring out what my um, healthy diet is going to be like because I've been eating a lot of bread and rice and I'm trying to stop doing that. Part of my spring cleaning has been I need to do all my laundry. I only have one basket and I usually wait until that basket is full so I could wash everything, including my sheets as well. With spring coming right around the corner, I wanted to get some floral sheets on the bed and have some different silky pillowcases so I could feel more comfortable while I sleep. Doing laundry might not seem like much, but there is something super therapeutic about doing laundry for me. And it's a simple task that just gives me a sense of accomplishment and a sense of control in the midst of uncertainty, honestly. I haven't gone to the thrift store in a while and I recently did and found some cutesy little dishes for my kitchen that I really, really love the colors and the shapes. After I'm done with my spring cleaning, I wanted to just share with you that you should really embrace doing chores in your house and you should embrace always keeping it clean, just like I have. And to close out, I'm thankful for everybody who's been following me. I just found out I have over 50 subscribers on YouTube and I can't believe it because I didn't think many people liked watching things that people just do in their home in a very mundane way. Or even if you learned something from my videos, I'm thankful for you. And I hope that you have a wonderful spring. And I look forward to seeing you in my next video. Thank you. Bye.